everybody today we're looking at the Lenovo HW01 Plus Mio the PAI Smart Band now all of that that's a lot of words but let's get right to what this actually is so the important thing is that this Lenovo Smart Band is called a PAI Smart Band now PAI stands for Personal Activity Intelligence so what it does, it takes your, so it's a smart band, um, and it takes your, your sex, your age, as well as it measures your heart rate in real time. And what it does is over a period of time, once it has enough data, it will actually give you something called a PAI score. Now, the magic number is 100. So if your PAI score can be 100 or higher, it pretty much means that you will live a long and healthy life. That being said, let's look at this smart band that determines your longevity in a bit more detail. So here's the box, nice and small, compact, and as you can see, the Lenovo brand is there, and the PAI, uh, PAI logo is there as well. And this is what the uh, smart band is. That's the smart band. Comes with a nice, cute little uh, instruction manual. It has a uh, warranty information in there as well and at the bottom here there's just uh, some marketing materials on the PEI itself talking about what I just talked about uh, on a piece of paper talking about your personal activity intelligence the first activity metric based on heart rate that's scientifically proven to help you live a longer healthier life and I see here that PEI is the best example yet of how Wearables can turn data about our bodies into tailored, actionable advice, and hopefully longer lives. And this was quoted by a gentleman by the name of uh, Jeffrey Fowler from the Wall Street Journal. So you have the Lenovo brand, which is pretty pretty well-known brand, and we have you know quotes from people that work at the Wall Street Journal. So this is uh, a no-nonsense product. This looks like it's the real deal here. So here's the little instruction manual. It tells you about the armband, and it tells you about how to navigate it and what it looks like, and how you can actually charge it up. Okay, and this is the warranty information. We know what that's all about. So let's get to the meat of the matter here. Here is the smart band. Pretty, pretty typical looking smart band. This is a black one. It has a rubberized. Uh, or a rubber arm band um, strap pretty decent looking buckle uh, it's a uh, pretty good quality and uh, so yes you're asking me it's all rubber so is it waterproof yes this is waterproof you can run outside in the rain in this thing uh, and it's designed for that and even pr more proof of that if you look closely there are no ports on this thing uh, there are no physical buttons that move, right, where water can actually seep in. Um, there is a smart button right here. It looks like our, it looks like an Apple button, but it's just a simple little circle. So it's actually with this button that you do all your navigation. Um, this is not a touch screen. You do everything through this button. Uh, smart button, which is pretty good. So you're asking, so how you charge it? Is it wireless charging? Nope. It actually charges via USB connection. So well hidden, you would never think to look where I'm going to show now, show you now. So here it is. To get to the to the USB port, this actually this band actually comes right off. Just pull it, and you put it that way, and it comes right out. So you have this device, right? And here's the USB uh, plug here. You plug this into your laptop or your PC or whatever, and it would charge it up, right? And here's the band, right? Just a piece of rubber, literally. This is what it is, right? So that's pretty good. And um, what's good about this is that on the band itself, there's a little pocket inside here for your little USB plug to go in. So it actually protects it from the elements, right? So from the rain and water and stuff. So that's pretty cool. So let's just put the band here aside for a second. Let's look at this closely. So we, this is the unit. There's your smart button, USB plug, and that's our screen which we're going to look at in a second. 
Now this does have a built-in GPS so it can do motion tracking as well so you can uh, have a map and, and it can actually track where you've run or walked. Of course there's a built-in calorie counter in this thing, there's a pedometer. Uh, there's another, there's another um, cool reminder, there's something called a sedentary reminder so if you sit down for too long it will actually vibrate and tell you to move your you know what so you can get some exercise and burn some calories. Um, of course you can set this like a normal watch so it has a, an alarm um, it does have Bluetooth 4.2 in it as well and um, I did say it's waterproof because it's IP67 rated as well so water and dust proof it does phone call reminder it does messaging as well so if you get a text message on your phone it will tell you that you have a text message if you have a phone call incoming call it will tell you that there's an incoming call you cannot make or receive calls on this but you can at least see when somebody's trying to call you on your main phone, it will tell you on here, right? And of course, you can actually use this as a remote control. So you can actually remote control, like take, take a picture through your phone, smartphone, using this. So if you're doing like a selfie and you don't, and there's nobody around to take a picture for you, put your phone on a tripod and then you can take a picture using this, uh, using this device through your phone. And there's also remote music, so you can actually control your, your media play on your phone using this as well. And of course, there is a WeChat notification uh, capability on this as well. Uh, I know WeChat; it's a uh, it's a messaging app. I know it's very com uh, used a lot out east, like in China and those places. So this does actually support WeChat as well. So let's turn this on. So to turn it on, now to turn it on, all you do is hold this button down, this little soft button down for three seconds. So let's do that. So you saw the Lenovo, the Lenovo logo, and this is what it looks like. Now, as I said, there's no touchscreen functionality, so what you always have to do if you want to uh, activate the screen is press that soft button, right? And you can see the time there, and you can see the battery indicator at the top, and along the bottom here is the date. And um, at the top, as I said, there's your battery indicator, right? So you cannot, like use any sweeping gestures because it is not a touch screen what you do however you just keep pressing this everything you do is with this one little smart button which is really cool so you just press it it gives you your pedometer um, rating so of course I haven't done any steps on this thing as yet on this thing as yet um, so of course when you're navigating um, you do everything with this little smart button this soft smart button which is very good right you don't have to be fun, 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 fumbling around swiping or looking for buttons on the side it's right here you just press and it comes up and then if you just press it again it gives you your pedometer uh, reading it gives you your beats per minute if you're taking a heart rate and as you can see the heart rate monitor was just on um, and it's telling me right now oh you have to put it on and of course I don't have it on right now but if I press it again Let's see if we're in that same mode. So go back there. Heart rate. There you go. That's the uh, monitor. That's the sensor there that you just saw. So yes, I, I will put it on um, smartwatch in a second. <laughs> and uh, that was the little image there. So let's keep going. So the pedometer, heart rate. This tells you your kilometers. So you can actually, as I said, track where you've walked as well on a map. That's why it shows you that map. Um, little map uh, icon um, and then here is it shows your calories burnt and we're back to the time so of course um, there's an application that you have to download on your phone um, where you can use to track where you've been on this via the built-in GPS on a map pretty straightforward a lot of smart smart uh, bands have that today but it comes in pretty handy if you just want to track your progress so let's see what else is here so if I just press this now and hold it down Here's our like main menu. So what you do, if I you see that it's the back button. So if I and if you just leave it there, it, it goes into that function. So if I leave it on back button, it's gonna go back to my last screen. So let me just go back to the watch screen and just continue going through the menu here. Hold it down again. And then if I just keep pressing it, it moves through the menu items, right? So there's just those four. So that one was just to go back. If I let this one go, it goes to this is where it actually starts recording my running, right? That's what, all right? So it records my running and it records my heart rate and, and all of that, right? 
calories burnt and everything. Um, and then to stop it, I just press it again. But yes, it's going to read my heart rate. I'm going to do that in a second. <laughs> but it's just asking me to connect back, put the, the watch back on. I'm just going through the menu here. So what else is there? Okay, let's get out of that. So let's press again. Let's hold down the, let's get back to that menu. Right, so that was that one where I'm exercising. This one is to turn it off. So let's go back here. And let's see what else is there. I think that's it. It's very simple, but very powerful. A very powerful uh, gadget. So I turn it off. I just go here. And it says bye. So let me just put it on. Let's demo it taking my heart rate because it's been asking me several times to put on your smart band so it can take my heart rate okay so I have to light dim like this so you can actually see the screen nice and clearly right because it's a really cool monochromatic screen so let's go back in here turn it back on that's the time so again we did we tapped it right to go through so of course it's not going to measure my um walking because I haven't walked in it yet so right now it's taking my heart rate and actually at the time of doing this video I did a 10k about two hours ago so I should be pretty yeah see that's pretty normal I've been running around since I did my 10k so it took that in what like five seconds I find out with a lot of these smart bands uh, a lot of times if it's, your watch is not on properly it tells you oh it's, it's not on properly or it takes a while but this does a very good job of taking my um, heart rate now the Lenovo H w01 plus um also um can vibrate if you actually overtrain um if you train too hard and overexert yourself and the blood your blood um and your you know your heart rate goes above a certain amount it will vibrate to tell you you're going too hard please slow down so that's a really good feature as well now the screen it's an oled screen and it has a 128 times 32 resolution and it also has a 0 0.91 inch screen size as you can see right there all right monochromatic white um led uh, or white characters on a dark on a black background which comes in very very handy in dark light as well you can read it pretty clearly as well as in the day now this smart band um as i showed you earlier it's a this is a silicone band right so it's pretty really strong and very flexible and uh, it can you know designed for you to open and take this thing out and put it back in many times without damaging the band now when it comes to phone compatibility when it comes to android phones it's compatible with android uh version 4.4 and higher phones and if you are a, a, an apple uh, person and you have an iphone uh if you have ios 8.0 and higher um, the app and the device works very well with it as well from a dimensions perspective you're looking at um 23.5 um, centimeters um, long times 1.2 um, centimeters wide times one centimeter um, in thickness right now of course when we're talking about 23.5 centimeters long we're talking about you know end to end like end to end including the, the device in the middle the band and everything as well right so like that's a really good dimension if you want to you know you know you know if, how well would it fit in your wrist if you have a huge wrist uh, how would it look uh, would it fit so that and it's designed pretty, to fit you know pretty much most adult size wrists uh, as you can see there uh, it's pretty 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 good now this smart band is very very light it weighs next to nothing it actually only weighs 25 grams right 25 grams that's like I don't know why I can compare that to maybe uh, as light as a you know a dollar coin or something but it's very very light 25 grams um, it has that USB direct plug that I talked about and it also has this really cool feature called anti-sleep mode so um, if you're night driving or if you're a truck driver or if you are very very tired but you have to stay awake um, this will actually um, vibrate um, to, to remind you to focus on what you're doing so here I'm in the Google Play Store so I'm going to search for Lenovo Smart we have bracelet, bracelet app, wow, so many different things, but the actual instruction manual says uh, type in uh, the Lenovo Smart Bracelet, yes, so bracelet. And here it is, so I'm going to install it. Now remember, this does have Bluetooth 4.2 as well, so that's how it communicates with the phone. So open, 
Whoa, look at that. So here's where you actually uh, enter your email and password. You can then set up um, an account. So I'm going to do that now. So to connect via Bluetooth, all I did is activate my Bluetooth on my phone and it found the device. So I'm just going to click on it and pair. So I've done nothing on this. All I did was just turn it on and turn on my Bluetooth. So I've automatically connected um, to my device. So let me just click to bind. And I just op I just created this dummy profile called John. So here I am. So I have all my particulars in there. And here is where I can access my WeChat units. Like this is where I can pretty much set my settings in my phone. So pretty much in this app, all you do is use this app to track all of your metrics. So here you can see your steps, your distances uh, that you've covered, calories burnt, and duration. And here would be a nice graph, right? So obviously you're not going to see a graph because I'm just I just took this out the box. I haven't used it yet. But of course, I will have a full graph after using this for a full week <laughs> or at least a full day of activity. So it tracks everything here. And of course, um, you know, all the data that is captured in here, you can actually, you know, download it and keep it on your app. Right. So that's that's the app. So it's pretty intuitive, very easy to install, easy to set up the Bluetooth. Um, and again, it's a Lenovo product. So it, you're, getting, you're getting a pretty good deal here. So ladies and gentlemen, that was the unboxing and initial review of the Lenovo HW01 Plus Mio PAI Smart Band. Right? This little thing here can tell you to get up if you're sitting down for too long. Um, it's waterproof, so you can run outside with it. I wouldn't recommend going in the shower with it. Um, and it doesn't weigh pretty much anything. You can hide it hides under your your your, your sleeve of your of your, your shirt. You know, it's out of the way. But it monitors your heart rate, everything, and it even gives you a PAI score. If you keep it above 100, you know you're going to live to 100, <laughs> and uh, that's pretty good as well. And it has a nice cool app that you can you can look through, look at your phone, and look at all your metrics, and track your progress there as well. So don't forget, if you want to get yourself one of these devices and as well learn more about them, check out the link below the screen. And uh, you can get them off of Gearbest um, for a very, very great price. These things are very, very inexpensive. Um, so, yeah, check the link below. You get more details on this product as well as you can buy them from uh, Gearbest. So that being said, guys, have a great, healthy day. And keep on exercising. Keep active and keep healthy. And as well, have fun. This is Richie signing off. Bye-bye. Hey, everybody. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Now I'm going to ask you to do two things before you leave. One, there's a button right up here on the screen to my right here. Click on that and that will take you to our website www.redtechbot.com. When you get on that site there will be a button there where you can actually sign up for our newsletter and when you do sign up for our newsletter by entering in your email address you will automatically be entered into all of our tech giveaways and by tech giveaways these are some typical examples of what we will be giving away uh, and these are some examples, there's other stuff as well. Um, and the good news is you're, you, know, you just have to enter your email address once and you know, it will automatically be entered into the pool every time we do a draw. Um, and we will use that email address of course to, to contact the winner to tell them hey you've won something um, and you know, it's, it's, uh, it's really cool. And of course the newsletter will have you know, you know, updates on tech reviews, what's coming up, new, uh, you know, what's coming up next. Um, you know, new stuff uh, in the industry and even information on, on future giveaways, right? So it's really, 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 really nice newsletter that we're going to be uh, uh, sending out. And one other thing is on this side on the screen here up here, on my left, uh, you click on that and you will subscribe to the channel. Now by subscribing, of course, you will be, you know, at the forefront of any new things that are happening, any new videos that are coming out. Um, and what I will also be doing is I'll be doing videos where I'll be talking about what we're going to be doing as a next giveaway, right? So you want to be, you know, subscribed, tuned in to that as well. So it's going to be a fun year and fun years to come as well. So, yeah, that being said, you guys have a great day.